May here with Hunter's customer success team, and today we are going to be reviewing how to find the email addresses of professionals based off of a company name or domain with the domain search. Let's get started. If we are not already on the domain search page, we can go ahead and click the finder option in the sidebar navigation panel to find it. To get started, we can enter in the domain or name of the company that we're trying to find emails for. Today, I'll go ahead and use the Hunter.io domain as an example. Once we've entered in our domain up top, we can see that the results page will populate, showing us an overview of available results, available filtering options for our search, and additional information on our domain. First, let's review how to prospect through our general domain results. You'll see in the results page there are two columns, one labeled All People and one labeled Decision Makers. Within the All People section, you'll be able to prospect through all of the domain results separated by department, as you see here. The Decision Makers column, on the other hand, streamlines your search by showing you only those contacts we've identified to be decision makers. Within the Results page, you can prospect through either section seamlessly. As you can see, the contact's name preview, as well as title, will be available before you reveal an email address. This allows you to pick and choose the contacts that you're spending credits on as you prospect through the available results. From here, if you'd like to refine your search further to service contacts of interest for you, you can utilize our filters as shown here. We have four filter types available, type, department, job title, and required fields. The type filter allows you to filter email address results by personal or generic. Personal addresses, of course, being something like john at company.com, whereas generic addresses are something like support at company.com. The department filter will allow you to select one or multiple departments to refine your search by. Similarly, the job title filter will allow you to refine email address results based off of job title keywords, and you can enter in one or multiple keywords to refine your search. Last but not least, the required fields filter will allow you to refine results based off of the available data points for those leads. For example, if I select position and full name, Hunter will only show me results that have both a position title and a full name available. If you do happen to know the name of the contact you're searching for within this domain, you can enter in their full name here to see any matching results. Next, let's go ahead and review the information available once we reveal an email address and associated lead record. First and foremost, the email address for this contact can be seen here. If a full name is available for the email address provided, it will be shown directly above the email address. And if this contact is a decision maker, you will see this crown icon directly next to their name. Below the name and email address, you will also see a verification status for this lead. Hunter pre-verifies results whenever possible. If we have already verified the email address, you will see the result here. And if we have not already verified the email address, you will have the option to do so directly from the search. To the right, you can see the job title associated with this lead will be provided whenever available. And directly below that, you can see the social media profiles as well as any phone numbers available will be listed. At the bottom of the lead result, you can always review the source for the result provided. We will provide an active link to the source along with a date associated with the source. If the source has been removed, we will also denote that in the lead record for you. No credits will be charged as you prospect through the results here until you choose to reveal a contact's email address as shown here. If, as you're prospecting through the results, you'd like to select multiple leads or even entire departments at one time, we will always show you the cost of saving these contacts to your leads or exporting them to a CSV file right at the top here. The domain search also provides information on the company you're searching on the right-hand side panel. Here, you can find a small description for the company, any social media or website links for the company, general information about company demographics and the domain, technologies this company might be using, as well as similar companies that might be of interest to your search. At the very top of the right side panel, you can also choose to follow this company this will allow you to receive updates from Hunter when new email addresses become available for this domain, and it also allows Hunter to keep you up to date on any hiring or funding news from this company. I do hope this video was helpful as you're getting started with the domain search. 
But if you'd like any additional help refining your search or moving forward to the next steps in your outreach, please don't hesitate to reach out to our team via the website chat here or via email at contact at hunter.io. Thanks so much.